took a bike ride from El Segundo to uh, Play del Rey, a little place called DNW. But anyway, we rode our bikes down to the beach and uh, I saw these guys surfing. And to me, I thought that was like the most amazing thing I'd ever seen in my entire life. I got my first surfboard was a Dewey Weber surfboard, an 8'4", 22 inches wide, basically kind of like what I'm making now for myself. And actually had blue paneled rails, <clears throat> but it was a single fin. And uh, that was my first surfboard. And uh, just I can remember my very first wave. Um, just I'd go out as far as I can, waist deep, and then I'd jump on my board. Hopefully I'd get to my feet before I hit the sand. And uh, uh, that, I, I probably never even made it to my feet for the first three days. But uh, just the glide, just the feel, just the having the ocean push you for that free ride is incredible. I mean, I, it's just to me, it's just really cool. My last year of high school, I actually got on a competition team, which was uh, uh, down in South Bay. Uh, Venice Beach, uh, Dewey Weber surfboard was uh, really a uh, very famous guy, very really good surfer, probably the first guy who really actually, actually maneuvered and, and hot dogged a surfboard. And that's where hot dogging came from, kind of from him. And uh, I actually got a job when I was in high school working at Dewey Weber surfboard shop in, in, uh, in Venice. And I actually I was making tail blocks, foam tail block, colored ones. and then I got to go into uh, using the shaping machine, not actually shaping, but just uh, had this big router that they'd route the, route the blanks over. And uh, There was a guy named Harold Iggy who used to shape all the boards for Dewey Weber and a guy named Pack. And uh, that's basically how it all kind of started. As I've gotten older over the you know, last 50 years, uh, um, I'm kind of basically going back to what I learned how to surf on. And there was one time there was a, a Weber mini feather that Dewey Weber came up with. And that's basically what I'm riding now is like a 7.6, uh, 7.11, 22 inches wide, 18 inch nose, 15 inch tail, 2 and 3 quarter, round pin, 4 fin. And that sounds like a lot, but uh, it's actually what I call a senior citizen hot dog board for a person my age. Uh, it's just the type of board that you can have the early entry, uh, you have the 4 fin skate, uh, you can actually ride the tip. Uh, the cutbacks are fantastic, and especially with the EPS blank that it is, it's a very buoyant blank. So we need uh, all the help we can get by, you know, being up out of the water and having that early entry to get into the wave and having the rhythm of the wave work for you instead of against you. And uh, that's basically what I'm right.